my name's Emily, welcome to my channel. I make home education vloggy style videos with my seven year old daughter Rosie. Um, kind of forgot to film a little bit this week though we have been busy so if I go backwards maybe I'll remember where where we were. Yesterday it was Friday and she had a birthday party in the evening and I work in the day. Um, but when we got back uh, she normally helps on a Friday afternoon with the shopping so she helps um put things away understand what comes in the shop um she normally brings it out so she understands that certain things go in the fridge and other things don't um then thursday we made some new well tuesday we made some new friends so thursday after my parents came down um we went and met them at the, we met my new friends at the park and they're greek and they're going to start teaching us some greek and they're going to um invite us to share some greek food with them at some point um so and help us book holiday over there at some point as well um so that would be nice um and then wednesday i work and i had um lessons in the evening as well and tuesday we went to the lake and uh rosie socialized and got lots of fresh air and pe um, Monday we had to wait in most of the day for an appointment that did not occur to have our broadband installed so at the moment we're without internet so if I don't um, post too much or this is slow going up that would be why. Um, so yeah it's been a bit of a bitty week we've done lots of little sit down bits in between Rosie's really been into colouring she's been into our little mini mandala book and into the colouring and um, we've kind of been doing a lot of walking uh times tables we do and we also do spellings rosie's been doing really really well with spelling recently and she's also been composing her own song um so i don't know if i'll put that in this video because it's not complete yet we lost our drummer this week because um well short story short sh long story short i had a falling out with a friend who was going to put drums to it and um they weren't grown up enough to st to still be able to make that happen so um uh yeah poor rosie's missing out there um but yes the fact she's more interested in music now is really really lovely for me because i love that we can share something that i'm very passionate about as well and i'm looking forward to her showing a bit more enthusiasm towards sitting down and learning an instrument because then i will make a regular practice time for her to actually sit down and do it so uh, i'll get into the video and show you what we a beautiful autumnal walk down to the lake for the homemade group where they meet up and stuff we had to stay in yesterday for an appointment that didn't happen so we're a bit annoyed there's a squirrel squirrel baby and there's a dog or something behind us because i can hear it clinking um but yeah we're going off to be sociable today we'll look for signs of autumn i love this walk down to the lake we've seen like a dozen squirrels there's one in the tree over there and there's a blackbird. And there's another, there's another squirrel over there, Rosie's just watching. Did you not see that? I'm so yeah, there's, we've seen loads of squirrels, Babs. There's loads of them about. 
I know, and these beautiful trees. There's such stunning trees down here. And then we've got the beautiful river. Love our bodies of water. Or at least I do. Rosie will get her preferences as she grows up. Look at you down there. Rosie's showing off her strong legs. Pee. Look how strong you are. You okay? Careful standing up because it's still swinging behind you. They're good strong legs them. Good job. Rosie is doing some messy artwork, but she needs to tidy up because we've got guests coming soon. No, we don't. Um, she's making a collage. We have a celebrity coming. And we don't. We have Nanny and Bampy coming, and Bampy likes to sit. Back. Bampy has a bad back. He likes to sit at the table, so we don't want him to like have to sit amongst loads and loads of glitter. So Rosie needs to tidy up. I've got a matchstick collection. Um, we've been doing a little bit of singing. Rosie's been writing a song matchstick as well. Matchstick collection. Matchstick. It's finished. Matchstick collection. Matchstick collection. Very nice. Rosie's been writing a song. So when it's finished, we might post it somehow. Um. If we could, we need we need some sort of device app whatever to layer all the sounds because I can play f a fair few instruments, uh, but, but I cannot play them. Internet. But I cannot play them all at once. Yes, and we currently have no internet because Sky messed up. Um, well, their engineering I'm service OpenReach messed up. Yay. I'm not going for a job interview. I've no idea where people get that idea from. Just because I'm getting my CV sorted out doesn't mean I'm going for a job interview. Anyway, this is our Thursday. We're going to go meet up with friends later and. Um, waiting Vast. for my parents to arrive right now. Vast. So, other than our missed appointment, we've had a, a a good week. Next week, we well, next week's going to be exciting as well, but um, might be part of the following. Next week, we have hopefully some relatives coming to visit us on Monday. Um, Tuesday, I think we've got three at the moment. Then Thursday, we're going to see Midsummer Night's Dream at the theatre. And Saturday, we've booked in with some friends to go and do this escape room in Cardiff on the street, um, Alice in Wonderland experience, which I'm really looking forward to. And I'm hoping our friends got the secret location soon. Um, otherwise, she might want to double check that they've got her email address right. Um, so, yeah, we've kind of... We do do sit down work, but we tend to like do a lot in one week or in one day and then do a lot of walking around learning um, the rest of the time. Um, we do have some projects coming up because we have our holidays booked uh, well, for Iceland and obviously Halloween's coming up. So we do some Halloween related um, learning and then it will be nearly Christmas. And then, um, yeah, so it will just be nice to... I'm enjoying going with the flow at the moment, but the teacher side of me is very much, we need to do something that's sit down. We need, we need written proof she's learning, <clears throat> but I think that's just the part of me that <clears throat> isn't used to being um, child-led. But Rosie does thrive on a little bit of structure, and there are things I want her to know. Um, for example, um, swimming is a priority for us. Um, because we want, I, I think it's a life skill. Um, I'd also like her to be able to cycle, so we need to kind of up our game on that and ask her dad to help out a bit more with the cycling. Um, she needs to work on her little letters, and uh, we need to do a bit more complicated maths around shape work and things. Um, so, yeah, the little bits that she needs to do, but at the moment she does really, really well. She reads so much. She's learning everything she wants to learn about from books. She picks up books and we read so much. Um, and we're entering all sorts of different things. Like she's part of the reading challenge. She should get a certificate and a medal soon for completing the reading challenge from the library. Um, she goes to Beavers every Monday and does social things and life skills. Same with Brownies on a Thursday. And then she does a drama group on a Saturday. So she's a... She's a busy little girl, um, so she also deserves her downtime as well. Um, so, yeah, uh, how does your homeschool or home education week look? And do you unschool? Do you Charlotte Mason? Or do you, what's your structure? If you want to comment below, then leave us a message. And now it's Tata from me and Tata from the Rosie Bear.